energy exchange. So maybe she's not confident to do the live because she don't have my energy. Wait. What, does she have to get in tune with the with the frequency first? Like that, I don't have that. Then, then I'm talking. Let me understand something. Doesn't she have to get in tune with the frequency first? Okay. Before she can feel, you've been here two years. You was eight months under me as a student before nine months. You were almost a year up under me before we even had sex. And then you still didn't understand my mind. And to this day, and to this day, and to this day, but but to this day, but still, she just, she just got here. Okay. We're not going live at this point. At this point, we're showing. We're not teaching at this point. We're teaching through through, through demonstration. These different people like Ephraim here. All right. Listen to what I'm saying to you. We're in a different stage of teaching right now. This stage of teaching is not about talking. Let me finish teach. talking and don't interrupt me when I'm talking. Mm. Ephraim come, she don't talk. A lot of people that come to talk, it's a different talk now. It's action. We're showing our life now more than teaching it. The teachers are already there. People already got the teachings. Now we're showing the knowledge. It's a difference. The teachings and then show. So there's different energy here to show and give us a model. Like this woman is more of a model. This woman is a model. She don't, she don't go live like that. But they are here to show our knowledge. This is a different stage in our teaching. You have to understand that. The intellect is always cool. And some of us are intellectuals. But more than likely... And you see this, the way she's standing? Correct them. You did it before them. Correct them. Oh, Chief, I, I thought that the, the weird wives were... Oh, okay, you're right, you're right, you're right. Hey, mm. right, listen. So you have to understand one thing. We are now showing the world what we're about. We, we spent almost a year, two years talking. The talk is no more talk. We show now. So this woman is coming to get in tune. She getting in tune is different from you. You want her to teach, but she's a... Go ahead. I never said that I wanted her to teach. We were never teaching anything. We were, we're teaching. always teaching. Well, we're teaching, but not like... Not what is a live? What is a live? A live is to do what? To go teach, right? Yeah, but it's, it's not like... That's more like an expression. More like expressing ourselves. Like that. As far as bonding. So, wait, wait, wait. So, so she not... first come here and you're like, yo, let's go live. And she like, I'm a little nervous. You, you respond. Yeah, I'm ready for live. Like, so right, I understand live. that. I understand that. But she said she was nervous, right? She said she was nervous, right? What is that attitude for? She never said that she was nervous to go live. What did she say? She just said she just said that I don't I don't it just was like a no. Just All right, so if she said no, what are you supposed to do as chief this? I, if I say yeah, then she's gonna have crazy energy in the video and then it's gonna come off weird and then so what what am I supposed to do? You're supposed to see why. That's what. But you don't wanna see why. You wanna not like her. That's not true. You want to find a reason to not like her. That's a fact. That's and instead of you going to her and say, why don't you want to go live or bringing that up in a meeting and communicating, you subjectively took it in your own mind to think whatever you wanted to fucking think. No, because she told you just moments later that she felt like she could do No, but you should have brought the meeting up before she said that to me. I didn't think about no meeting. I didn't think about But when she said no to you, you're supposed to be like, you don't say no to me. I you do what I tell you to do. Listen. want us to do it. Right. It's not about the universe. See, that's what your problem is. You keep allowing... Your, your universe is trying to make you take control and become chiefess. And your universe is going to do what you tell it to do. When you become a god, your universe you, it does what you tell it to do. You keep asking your universe for shit. That's your problem. I teach you to do what? I teach you to tell your universe what to do, right? Do you not have the power to do so? So why don't you do it? Are you not chiefess? Do you not embody the energy of a goddess? It has to be in you, Eliana. It has to be in you. You're in the position of power. You have to use the power. You can't keep asking your universe for shit. Especially when you say something, it should be done. Two years, Eliana. Two years. I've been invoking the spirit to come out of you. Now, if it doesn't come out, it's not there. Either you achieve this, or you a goddess, or you're not. I can't make you something that you're not. So you're going to get on the ball, or what? You communicate everything. We're communicators. We don't have no problems. We have what? 
Solutions. Sound the fuck off. We don't have problems. We have what? Solutions. It could be strong. <laughs> it could be strong. We got a lot of masculine women here. We don't have problems. We have what? Solutions. And through communication, we solve everything. Baby, getting an attitude, being petty, we don't do that. That's not God's. We're gods and goddess, so we have communication. Everything in the universe is communicating. There's cooperation, there's order, and there's structure all throughout nature because of communication. And we're on the same frequency. We have a problem, we talk it out. Now, if you feel threatened by Ra, let me know. No, I don't. You don't feel threatened by Ra. Mm. So why, when she said, no, she don't want to do live, you just took it as that? Oh, she don't want to do live. Because I didn't think that, I thought that maybe the universe didn't want us to do it. The universe, see? You see what I'm saying? You see what I'm talking about? What should you have done? This is sad. As to why she didn't want to do it? Exactly. And then manipulate it so that it happens for you, right? The, the way you want it, right? Space. Hello? And yes, I say child. Did you want to go live? Or was your feelings hurt when she said no? I just don't want to Was your like, feelings hurt when, when she do, said no? When you Was your feelings hurt when she said no? No. You were lying. It wasn't hurt. It I was. was. Part of the collective. You was offended by her no. No, absolutely not. Because she should have been feeling the way you felt at the moment, and she wasn't, and it offended you that she said no. No, it didn't. And you went along with it. No, it didn't hurt my feelings. Yes, it did. That's why I still went live. Cause but from that point just... on, you had an attitude toward her. Yeah, I Because know. it hurt your feelings. Mm. Never hurt my feelings. Because it hurt your feelings because Ross said no. Yes or no? No. And until you get to that point where you ever be able to overcome. See, your problem is you think one thing and you feel another. Your feelings say one thing and you think it in another. You're thinking, oh, yeah, all the laws. But you're feeling, your feelings is hurt. But you, now, guess what? Your thoughts are moving you, but your feelings are pushing the vibration. So you got two different things. So when somebody says, what's wrong with you, Eliana? You're like, nothing. But your feelings are still there, and it's vibrating. We can feel it. So you're lying to your own self. You see what I'm saying to you? So let's think deeply and be honest and be transparent about it. My feelings was not hurt in that moment. What, you, what would you call it then, if it wasn't hurt? What would you call it? I just felt a little bit confused on why she wouldn't want to go live. About so you felt confused. I want to know the emotion. Because the emotion is what moved you to feel from that moment. What was it, two days ago? Yeah. This was two days ago. You've been holding that energy from that moment. And that energy has been permeating for two fucking days in all of your actions. Under, underlining. It's been permeating through the whole thing. And instead of you, at that moment, addressing it, you carried it for two days. It has not been two days. It's been two it's days since that yesterday. moment. It wasn't yesterday. It was the day before yesterday. And I know it was the day before yesterday. Whatever day it was. Yeah, you see, you don't even understand. You don't even see it. You carried that same energy. And so, and so when... Oh, Thank you for the press, bro. Sit her down. Sit her down. I'm Eliana. Fine. I'm fine. You fine? You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. She said she's good. So two days you've been carrying the same energy around, and now everybody has to suffer because you... And so I'm trying to take a picture, and I'm feeling the energy, and I know exactly where it's coming from, but you know what irks me the most? Mm. Because you do this every fucking time, and it takes you two to three days to get over some emotions, some little petty shit. And you say that it's nothing wrong, and then I have to dig deep inside of your own psyche to show you what your feelings are every fucking time, and I don't have I don't time for that. Feelings. You don't know what you're feeling because you still haven't admitted it. You said you were confused. You said you were confused. Right? What was the emotion when she said no? Confusion. Why, why wouldn't you want to go live? Okay, but the confusion is a negative emotion, is it not? If I'm confused about something and somebody says no, you be like, the fuck? It throws a red flag, right? Confusion throws a red flag, right? Why wasn't that red flag addressed? I don't know. No, no, no. You should know so you can fix it. If you don't know, then it's going to happen again and again and again. It keeps happening. Until you know, will you ever stop? You have to stop this behavior. You can't be doing this because it's messing up our reality. It's taking me back to when you told me that... 
to take control over my reality. That's what it goes back to. Communicating. So and when it threw the red flag, why didn't you deal with it? I'm really scared of this monster. The initial thought I had was maybe the universe don't, doesn't want us to do it. But then I saw Aya energy and I was like, because if the energy wasn't supposed to flow, I've seen what energy was supposed to flow and what energy wasn't supposed to flow. So I, it, it, when I see Aya's energy, it confused me even more. I was like, I'm going to just leave it alone because I don't want to make her do anything that she doesn't want to do because that energy is going to come off into the camera. It's gonna come no, off no, no, no. It's not about that. It's about you addressing. It's about you addressing the emotions and the red flag. It's not about, oh, the universe, but you still was feeling the feelings. So your thoughts said, oh, the universe did this, but your feelings were, yo, what the fuck? Right? Your feelings were, what the fuck? Red flag, right? And you can, you can say, I don't know what those feelings were. Not Maybe the feelings were confusion, but the feelings of confusion could have been, it's confused because you don't know how you felt. But what you really felt was hurt because she said no. And, and you, could, you, could, you could say it was confusion, but let me allow you to help you. When someone says no, it feels a rejection. Mm -hmm. It's a feeling of rejection. You felt rejected in that moment because that was your idea. Your idea was rejected. Now, you could say I was confused because you was like, why? Now, the why is what happens after the feeling of rejection, which hurt. She hurt your feelings, but you said, I was confused, but the confusion came from the fact that you couldn't even understand how you felt when she did that to you. You think what I'm saying to you? So until you get to the point where you're like, yo, I was hurt because she rejected me. I wasn't you. hurt though, that's, that's, that's the thing. I wasn't hurt by you that. Were, you said that you were confused, yeah. right? If you were confused, that means you don't know how you felt. No, I know how I feel in that moment. I felt like I wanted to go live. And even when she said no, I still felt like I wanted to go live. No, 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 I'm not, no, no, that's pride. Fuck your pride. Fuck your pride, okay? We need, we need a real, if we don't get to the, to, the, to the essence of the problem, if we don't get to the seed of the problem, then these weeds are going to still grow. We can chop the weeds head off, but the, if, the, if the root is not plucked, then it's going to grow right back. So we keep chopping the weed head off, and the fucking weed just grows right back. It doesn't matter. We want to get rid of the weed, you want to get rid of the problem, you pluck it from the root. So Eliana, if you don't understand your own emotion, this is going to continue to happen, and it has, and I'm tired of this shit. Because everybody wakes up, you know, deal with their problems, and you, you carry and fester shit for two, three days and shit. And no one, you hide it, it'd be something so little, so sensitive, like just bring a red flag, and you don't deal with it. And so now, guess what? Now we have to deal with the energy and figure out and play the mystery game, clue, what's going on with Eliana, what's wrong with her today, and then if it wasn't for me paying attention to you so well, I wouldn't even know where to start to find out what's wrong with you.